first in our series of General Election 2015 specials. That's right, over the next week we'll be interviewing the Bristol candidates, hopefully shedding some light over what they stand for and what they can do for you, the voter. We've got all the MP hopefuls from the Bristol North West and the Bristol West seats so that all you students from Stokes Croft to Stoke Bishop will be more informed about who you might want representing you in Westminster. With just one week to go before the big vote, make sure you stick around and subscribe to our channel. We'll be using the hashtag UBTV election. We try to be as impartial as possible and the order in which we release the videos has been completely randomised. But up first, it's the turn of the Tories. Now the candidates here are Claire Scott and Charlotte Leslie. Claire will be challenging a fairly safe Lib Dem seat, but Charlotte's got it all to play for. She has been the MP for the seat for the past five years and won national acclaim back in 2013 when the Spectator named her the backbencher of the year. She also in 2011 was voted sexiest MP. So, let's see what they have to say. I'm Charlotte Leslie and I'm the Conservative candidate for Bristol North West, which is a very marginal seat. So, uh, one of the seats that could decide government, so no pressure or anything. <laughs> Conservatives are really power to the people. Um, I'm a Conservative because I believe that people are better at spending their own money and deciding things than institutions and governments are. And however good the intention of creating an equal society by taking people's money and then redistributing it, you always find that the people doing the redistributing have bigger cars than the people they're redistributing to. I never wanted to get into politics. I thought it was rubbish. And I thought it was full of people looking at themselves and not what needs to be done in the world around us. And I ended up with my lovely Oxford Classics degree, cleaning out loos, stacking chairs, um, doing some swimming teaching and some lifeguarding, and as a gym instructor as well. But this was not what I planned. Actually, having become an MP, that's the best experience I could possibly have had. I do know what it's like to be on the bottom of the pile. I do know what it's like to have some pervy senior lifeguard smack your bottom at the pool you're working at. That's actually proved a very, very good grounding for being an MP. MPs need, as far as possible, to be normal. Otherwise, how can you represent people? So it's vital that I go down the pub, and of course, it's never a chore, and I do like a pint of beer. <laughs> I'm Claire Scott. I am the Conservative candidate for Bristol West. Uh, a little bit about me. I live in Redland, lived in Bristol for 18 years, married with two teenage children, so very interested in students and their, their prospects. I haven't always been a political animal. Uh, I joined a party a few years ago because so I thought I've grown up enough now to have an opinion. So I, I looked at uh, the, the history of the parties and I thought, actually, in my heart, I'm Conservative. But what's really in my heart is health inequality. Uh, you, the, the life expectancy uh, in Lawrence Hill is about eight years less than in Clifton, and that's not right. And if you were to take one of your rival candidates out on a date, in Bristol, where would you take them and which one of your candidates would you most like to see opposite the opposite the candlelight? Ooh, oh, I'm sure they all look lovely in candlelights, don't they? Um, I'm torn. Torn between taking Darren Hall or Paul the UKIP guy. So probably I'd take both of them and I'd say, come on guys, you're nice, sensible people. Um, and actually, you're both in the wrong party. Somewhere on White Ladies Road, perhaps um, the cow shed or somewhere. Listen carefully.